It misses the mark. Washington comes from six points down in the fifth set to win the match and advance on to the regional final. I think some of our team goals were, it sounds kind of weird, but to let it hurt. Um, I think that was a game that we all um, aren't going to forget for a while and we're going to feel that, but um, let it hurt so that we use it and we don't ever want to have that same feeling ever again. We don't want to be up that big um, and, and lose that big of a lead and um, end our season on that kind of a note. So I think we all just kind of, we took our time when we got to be home and um, took care of ourselves mentally, physically, but when we came back we knew it was go time and we knew that we had big goals um, overall for the whole season and so the summer was where that all started. Being a veteran group definitely helped a ton. We, with only losing two seniors and having Tori and Anna return, I think that is huge for us just with experience wise and having to not really have to worry about reteaching and re-going over everything with the freshmen. We could just get right into it. First day of practice and not really go over any of the drills. We have a lot of great leaders. We have Iko, Tori, Claire, Mia. Everyone on the team leads a little differently and I think that's something that sets us apart from other teams because we have so many great leaders that people can look for in different situations. When I'm looking at the roster and seeing who sticks out, I mean, it'd be really easy to just find, you know, something from everybody because I think we've all improved. Um, but, you know, Anna Stevenson's one who I think coming here as a transfer, she's somebody who year to year, phase to phase, continues to improve and I think it's really, really impressive. I think additionally, you look at Aiden Bartlett who came in last year and she's made some really, really big strides physically and, and on court as well. And then lastly, you know, Elena Scott is somebody who, where she comes in is extremely impressive um, as, a, as a freshman. And so I'm really excited to watch her grow and develop within this program. The most exciting thing about all of that is that we've gotten better on court. We've gotten more physical than we were last year. And that's something that we pride ourselves on. We're bigger, we're stronger, we're faster, we jump higher, uh, we're more fit for the game, and we're better technically as volleyball players. The camaraderie as a group going through that 2020 season and all of those trials that just made our bond as a team a heck of a lot tighter. So I'm super fired up to see what this team does this year. They go back outside, a dig by Annika Larson. She could not keep it in, and that will do it. The Louisville Cardinals fend off the late surge by the Sun Devils. Beginning and end. Closes the door and that will take us through three. Holding serve here at home, now off to a 4-0 start, their best start since 2018. Left side, and Slaughter sends it wide and the cards pick up the point set and the match. Yafko back to Brinkman, why not? Stander keeps track of it. Here's Mbanu. Oh wow, Got that's it. an exclamation point. We've seen an awesome team take care of an excellent weekend, three separate conferences, three strong teams, an excellent Louisville squad has a fun season ahead of them. The 6-0 start is awesome. Um, I think it's the best start we've had since, what, 2005? And that's pretty crazy, so it's gonna be really exciting playing these teams because they're really gonna be out to get us. I think being an older team has helped us get off to a great start because it's easier to shake those early season jitters, I think. Once we get out there and we're feeling a little nervous, we're like, oh, we've been here before. For some of us, like, okay, year four, like, I've, I know how to manage this, and it's easier for us to shake that off and get the ball rolling. I think that in order to keep the momentum going, we just have to continue on with what we're doing, take each match as it comes, make sure that we're prepping seriously for each team, not underestimate anyone that's in our path.